Let's answer the number one asked question on this channel. Where is the tuning at with these 3.0 Duramax diesels? And let me tell you, I am a little bit closer than we were yesterday. So here's the deal. All right, so a couple months ago, we had several companies working on tuning for these trucks. And I'm referring to the 2020 to 2022 Silverado LM2 Duramax diesel. But let's also throw in the 2023 LZ0 since it's out now. And uh, hopefully we've got tuning being worked on for that as well. But let me tell you, so there's a couple companies dropping out. And um, I'm not speaking for any of these companies at all. This is strictly, I've done research. I've asked people that work at these different companies. I've asked, just, I've asked around, okay? I've, I've talked to a lot of people. And the one consensus that I have right now is everybody's dropped out because one, the ECM, let me correct that. I didn't mean everybody's dropped out, but most of the companies have dropped out. Everyone that's trying to tap into the ECM, I believe is having the biggest struggles with it. And they're kind of moving on from the project and it sounds like they're gonna come back to it at a later time, but not right now. So then we have the bank's Derringer still in the works and everybody's made the jokes I know I've been I've been seeing them. I'm, I'm part of them. I think it's funny too because they just haven't hit the deadlines that we all wanted. But let me tell you, it's still in the works. So that's fantastic news, especially when you consider that everybody else is scrapping these things or just delaying them. But the Derringer is still in the works. And from what I've been told, again, I'm not speaking for anybody, um, is that we're shooting for end of Q1 is the target date. So Q1 of 2023 which that's realistically only three months around the corner. And uh, that's fine. I think we can wait another three months for that thing, right? So let's just assume three to six months, you know, because the question that I asked was, what is taking so long? Why, why is the holdup what's going on? You know, is it the whole COVID thing delaying everything, you know, like all other performance products, but that doesn't seem to be the case. And uh, it seems more of a perfection thing and they just want it perfect for the end user. And that's what we've all learned on the bank's products is that they seem to be extremely high quality, top level, and we have that expectation on every single product that we get from them. So with them taking this additional time to make it even better, to make sure that it's trouble free, everything about it, that's pretty much what we want, right? So it's coming, that's the word that I've got right now. And um, I, would, I would call it a credible source, you know? So definitely a credible source and um, I do appreciate that info and as I get more info I'm going to relay it out to you but we need this Banks Derringer everyone's looking forward to it Banks knows that we want it so I would say keep letting them know that you want it so that way they continue working on it and don't scrap it like the other companies did because it was a little bit more difficult so as I get more info I'll share it with you until next time see ya